Before we can create a new organizational unit in Active Directory using PowerShell, we have to have the Active Directory module installed. So we use the new AD organizational unit to create a new OU. And the only required parameter is the name parameter. So we can create a new OU simply by specifying a name. And we can use the git ad organizational unit commandlet to retrieve that OU and validate that it was created. New ad organizational unit does support additional parameters as well. So if we wanted to specify the path, for instance, we can do that. And so I've got some additional example parameters here that I'm going to splat and pass through the new ad organizational unit commandlet. And using the git ad organizational unit commandlet, we can validate that that OU was created and it was actually put in the OU that we wanted it. That is how you create a new organizational unit in Active Directory using PowerShell.